Former This Morning presenter Philip Schofield's unanticipated return to TV has divided the nation after he revealed he took part in Channel 5's Cast Away. This week, the star, who last year quit his role at ITV after admitting to an unwise but not illegal affair with a much younger colleague, revealed he starred in Channel 5 series Cast Away, bringing an end to his quiet 16-month absence from TV and awards shows. The three-episode series follows the former Dancing on Ice co-host as he's stranded on a desert island off the coast of Madagascar for 10 days. They will be left alone to document their own experience using a variety of cameras. The synopsis for the show read, The famous face has to confront the challenges of total isolation, the forces of nature, and the battle within their own mind. On Wednesday morning, Philip announced the news by sharing images of himself filming for the show and told his followers, Now you know how I spent my summer. Alone for 10 days, no food, no water, no crew. My story of survival, both on a desert island and off it, before announcing the release date. While his followers may have loved the news, many of his former ITV colleagues weren't so sure of his return. After the news came out, Eamon Holmes, who hasn't been shy about his dislike for the presenter, had a very telling reaction. When his affair was exposed, Eamon was quick to take to social media and fume. Schofield has finally been caught out and branded ITV the Ministry of Lies. He also said that he and his former wife Ruth Langsford had been taken for fools by Schofield after comforting him life on TV when he came out as gay. Eamon said he had felt used and ashamed after his ITV colleagues had lied to him as he hid out at them on social media. On his GB News Breakfast show with Isabel Webster, the stars looked less than impressed with Philip's return to TV. Is this not just the chance for a narcissist to have more me time on screen? Fumed GP dear Renee Honderkamp. She added, I don't want to know his story. I'm not interested in it. I know that he's a celeb and people do seem to lap up any news, whether it's good or bad, but I think it's time maybe he stayed on the island. Meanwhile, former Home Office Minister Norman Baker fumed, So what? I don't want to know about it. I'm not interested in it. Why is the Sun giving two pages to it? I suppose it sells papers, but really, is that the most important thing in the papers? Isabel interrupted, adding, Well, he was one of our most high-profile presenters in the country. He was married, and he had two children when the scandal emerged. He lost all of his TV work, including Dancing on Ice. He fell out with his one-time best friend and co-host Holly Willoughby, who also, quite frankly, didn't she lose her job off the back of it all? Isabel added that Schofield had to leave social media in the wake of his scandal. My heart bleeds, fumed Baker, while Eamon let out a little chuckle. The broadcaster was heard adding, Very good. Loose Women star Nadia Sawalha was quick to react to Philip's news on her Coffee Moaning podcast, which she hosts with her husband Mark Adderley. Nadia explained her thoughts on the new show and said, the trailer was popping onto phones all over the place yesterday, and everyone was aghast. When I was first sent it, there was no message with it, so I thought it was a joke. She added, I just couldn't believe it. She further commented, First of all, I cringed. If I'm honest, I absolutely cringed when I saw that video. I thought, that is so embarrassing. That was my first feeling. When one person shared that they were keen to hear Philip's side of the story, Nadia responded, that's interesting because I feel he's told his side of the story. I feel like we've only heard his side of the story because he did that great big spread in the sun. And another interview. Nadia answered another person who claimed that Philip purposely rocked the unshaven look to evoke sympathy from fans. Nadia said, He's also very clever so I think he understands an audience, and I think he knows how to speak to an audience. So I think, yes, he'll be very, very careful. Later on in the podcast, she shared, he lied to everybody at work. He left people to deal with his as asterisk asterisk, I feel, in my opinion.